Doctors, the latest technology for patients who depend on a ventilator to help them breathe is now available in Connecticut. News 8 medical reporter Jocelyn Mementa found out how portable ventilators changing their lives. She joins us live tonight from our newsroom. Jocelyn. Sonia and Darren, portable ventilators have been around for some time now, but this one enables patients to live an even more independent life. Glenn Landers is now a familiar face in the hallways of Gaylord Specialty Healthcare. Before I couldn't get out of the room. A spinal cord injury has him dependent on a wheelchair. It goes pretty good. His newfound freedom is thanks to the latest portable ventilator. It will make it a, a lot easier for me. Absolutely. To go forever. The state of the art ventilator. Uh, Glenn, right now, is actually breathing for him. Comes with a 12 hour battery and a spare. It's the smallest that they make, uh, but at the same time, the electronics allow us to do all of the types of therapy we do with a full size ventilator. The software chief medical officer, Dr. Steve Holland, says benefits many more patients. Just that position of, of the lungs helps them to, to increase their, their lung capacity, helps avoid pneumonia, helps hopefully get them off the ventilator quicker. Glenn cannot breathe without a ventilator. When he breathes in, he gets a certain amount of air. Like when we breathe in, it's programmed to give him a certain amount, and so it pushes it out into him, and it's timed. And when the breath is done, then it comes back out. A speaking valve enables Glenn to communicate, and this new mobility has him venturing out, visiting other patients on his floor. I crashed the door. One woman's door. Were you going too fast? I think I was. The ventilator can also be plugged into the car, so Glenn is looking forward to an ice cream run with his girlfriend, Patty. Now, Dr. Holland tells me the makers are working to come up with a way to attach the portable ventilator to a walker device. Also, he says there could be a backpack ventilator down the road. Back to you.